Page 3, Drawing Accurate Lines. One of the most important thing, things that you can do with a CAD program is to be accurate. And there has to be a way of drawing a line that is exactly 3 and 1 fourth inches, or 2.65 units long. It's very easy to do. If you notice, you have a draw menu that has various things that you will learn as we go along. One of the things in the main part of the draw menu is line. We will learn a little bit about polylines, a lot about circles, and a little bit about arcs later on. But let's concentrate on the line. What we want to do is click the line icon and if you notice there's a little box that's kind of attached to my crosshairs and if you can look it does specify first point I'm gonna go ahead and specify the first point as I drag it along it's now gonna say up there next to my crosshairs specify the next point and you notice that it will allow me to stretch this line at any angle from 0 to 360. Right here in the middle of the screen there's this little goofy dude here with an arrow pointing saying F8. If you look at the very top of your keyboard you have function keys F1 all the way through F12. Hit F8 eight and see what happens. Notice that the line either goes straight across the screen or straight up and down. That's what you want to have on. Now as it says the ortho is on, this is where you're going to type in the size of the line. The line in question, the one that I started below, is 2 and 3 fourths. Let me show you how you type that in. You hit the 2 and separate the whole number from the fraction using the minus sign. So it's 2 minus, then you type 3, the forward slash, and then 4, and simply press enter. If you enter again, it will break the line string. So let's zoom in here and take a look at what that says. For instance, if my line that I'm drawing is 4 and 5 eighths units long, I would type 4 minus 5 forward slash 8. 2 minus 3 forward slash 4 for 2 and 3 fourths and so on. Hopefully that makes sense. Let's try this again. I'm going to choose the line. I'm just going to go a little bit below the red line there. My ortho is already on. My F8 button is already on. So I'm going to type 3 minus 1 over 4. Press enter. The line is drawn exactly 3 and 1 fourth. Let's go ahead and choose Enter. If you want to determine whether that line is exact, we can come over here and go to Dimension Linear. And we can press Enter and notice that the line is exactly 3 and 1 fourth. You don't need to know how to do the dimensions yet, but soon you will. First line was exactly 2 and 3 fourths. The next line is 3 and 1 fourth. Let's go back to our line icon. Let's aim just a little bit below the red line. Remember the ortho F8 is still on. And this is a whole number, so all you have to do is type 4 and enter. Let's come over here and let's draw 
a line. Go right next to the box. This time I'm going to start the line straight up. If I started the line to the left, the line would draw to the left. I start it straight up, it will start and draw straight up. 1 minus 3 over 4. Enter. Stretch it this way. The size of the line is 4 minus 5 over 16. Enter. Move it down. 1 minus 3 over 4. Enter. 4 minus 5 over 16. Enter. And when I enter another time, it breaks the line string. So you want to continue drawing the lines for each of the remaining sizes. 8 and 7 eighths, 1 and 9 sixteenths, 2 and 9 sixteenths, 3, and 3 and 7 sixteenths. If you have any additional questions, see me individually.